Oh my god, I'm so excited! I've been waiting to play Satisfactory forever! <laughs> I wanna play it! I wanna play it and enjoy it and love it forever! <laughs> Hello everybody, and welcome! to the Alpha Weekend of Satisfactory. I don't usually play Early Access Alpha Beta games on my channel. I usually wait. With Subnautica, I waited. With Slime Rancher, I waited. With... But I can't wait for this one! <laughs> I want to play it so badly! <laughs> so... Uh, real fast, before we actually get into the game, I just want to point out, here in the settings, in the gameplay settings, there's an arachnophobia mode. And I think that's nice. <laughs> I have arachnophobia. And it's got head bobbing to zero on default. Thank God I hate head bobbing. Ugh. So, you know, I'm just happy about that. <laughs> so, let, let's get into it. Once we get into it, I'm going to, like, real fast figure out where the heck my head should be. <laughs> and then we'll, we'll have ourselves a good time. So, uh, there's apparently three starting areas, but only the one is available in the alpha. So, that's cool. Uh, session type. Session name needs to be at least three letters, so uh, private will go with for right now. As is so satisfactory. Smiley face. A large area that is open and flat with frequent patches of biomass, build making building easier but distances longer. Oh. There. <coughs> Can't have the smiley face. Fine! <laughs> Whatever. Loading satisfactory! I'm so excited. <laughs> Let me in. Uh, all the settings are on ultra, and that's probably not going to be a good thing. <laughs> I'll have to fiddle with the settings. Ooh. Okay. Exit. Kitsit pioneers have three cyclical assigned pillars of work to ultimately accomplish project assembly. Alright. Sorry, I have it turned down. I didn't know what the sound was going to be like. Uh huh. <laughs> Expand your factory of outposts and pipelines through automation and augmentation. That's it. Get to work. <laughs> That's it. Get to work. Warning. Planet fall imminent. Please remain seated during full procedure. Okay. Atmospheric entry in five, four, three, two, one. Planet fall procedure initialized. We. Oh, it's like Subnautica, except I'm not crashing, I'm falling with style. <laughs> That's awesome. It is, it is a little quiet. I will have to fix that. But I, I, I can still hear it okay. Like, I'm, I'm not losing anything. You guys might be, and I'm sorry for that. Ooh. 
Plonk. <laughs> Efficiency first. Well, if <laughs> if you know my building habits, you know that that's that's not how I do. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's fix. Ooh. That's objective based introduction initialized. Welcome to onboarding. First objective please dismantle the drop pod. The resulting materials will be repurposed to construct a habitat and utility base from now on referred to as the hub. No, All right, fix it incorporated as cost effective and efficient. We do not waste. <laughs> nice. All right, press F to enter dismantle mode. Hold the primary fire to dismantle while in dismantle mode. Meow. Second objective. Please ensure you have your fix it incorporated. Wow, that's still really quiet. Leaving the drop zone. Note, like the music became loud, but Ada is still really small, really, really quiet. All right, let's... It's a work in progress! Once we get it fixed, everything will be fine. Once, once we, once, once it's all good, it's all good. Let's try that. All right, tab to open inventory. Drag equipment into the slot. The Xeno Zapper. It's a Taze gun. Please familiarize yourself with the resource scan. <laughs> it really is like Subnautica. Iron. Note, the acquisition of iron is considered essential in preparation for all future objectives. Ooh. What's that thing? A little buggy. It's a little buggy. I'm gonna go say hi to the bug. Oh no, it's not a bug. It's a bird. Hi, bird. Lizard bird. Oh, it's coming this way. Whoa. It's like the... Whoa! It, whoa! It's like the 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 sky fin things in Subnautica, but it's got like little babies, and it's freaking huge. That's uh whoa! Hi! You got a tiny head and a great big old body. Ah, oh, this is cool. This is cool. A plan satisfactory. Ah, oh. it's cool. I didn't think it would look like that. I thought it, from the way you described it, I thought it would be like a two D game. No, that's what makes it cool. It's like Factorio, but three D and cool. <laughs> yeah, it does look cool. Oh, I'm so excited! This looks so cool. All right, scan for resource deposits. Oh. And the building mechanics are kind of like rust, but you make factories with it? Yeah, well, maybe. I don't know yet. But uh, that that's what I'm assuming. Hmm. Alright, so it looks like there's ores in that general location. Let's go that way. Ooh, I can pick up leaves. Oh, it's so cool! Alright, he's gone. It's little. It's like a little fairy. Oh, it disappeared. They're like fairies. 
What's that thing? What's that thing? What what is that up there? Can I hit? Can I hit? Can I hit? Eh. <laughs> I want to get up there. Is there like no jetpack or anything? I want to get up there. Do I have to build like a ladder? I don't suppose I could like mark this on my map or something. I don't. Whatever. I'll come back to it. I'll figure it out. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Or I could climb up that rock and jump across. What is it? I wanna know. Please show me. Ah! What? Green power slug. Yes. This semi slug seems to emit weak potential energy from its crystalline shell. Further analysis of crystals required to determine application. Cool. Well, I have it now. Initial scans reveal coloring properties in the flower petals. Further analysis required. All right. So. There's something over here. Hold E to gather resources from... Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, God! Bad! Whoa! Bad! Bad! That's a bad animal! Bad! Alien creature carapace. Studying the remains... Oh, cool! It actually comes off! ...on how to defend yourself in the future. I recommend analysis. How do you analyze? I can't dismantle him. <laughs> All right, anyway. So let's find, ooh, iron ore, here we go. Fourth objective, build the hub. Note, to complete this objective, the resources salvaged from the drop pod will be consumed. Caution, ensure the hub is built on spacious open terrain close to the presence of iron sources. Failure to do so will likely result in non-optimal progress. Oh, here comes another one. Man, they see you from far away. That's a, that's a bad, bad, bad animal. Duh. Duh. <laughs> All right. Uh, well, it looks like there's more resources here. So let's just build it right here. All right. Build menu is Q, the hub. The heart of your factory. This is where you complete fix it milestones to unlock additional blueprints of buildings, vehicles, parts, and equipment. Ho ho ho. Alright. Uh, how do I rotate it? Scroll. Cool. I want it right there. Congratulations. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. Ow. Upgrade the hub by using the hub terminal, craft parts. Is there a way I can like re-listen? Congratulations. Oh hub good. Unlocked. Hub feature, manual craft bench. Hub feature, hub terminal, fifth objective, hub upgrade, storage and power. Note, the craft bench and hub terminal are essential for progression to the next objective. Awesome. Oh, thank you for putting that in the game. <laughs> that's, that's amazing. Alright. Uh... 
inbox. What's this? Ah. Power slug. Flower petals. Creature remains. Cool. Upgrade the hub by using the hub terminal. This blur, I'm not I'm not a super fan of this blur. It's also causing the game to lag a bit on the recording. I can assure you I have found I have had no issues. I only just looked over the recording. <laughs> Alright, let's turn down the uh the, the settings just so that you guys aren't having a terrible, terrible time. Let's try low and we'll go up from there. Let's keep that at medium. It's better. It's definitely better than it was. All right, this will be fine. All right, sorry you guys had to <laughs> had to suffer through that for that long. It's a it's a work in progress.